Hello everyone. Today we are going to see how to create and simulate an Arduino based alarm clock using Proteus. We all know what an alarm clock is. Uh, it alerts us about the time and the date and helps us in waking up in the morning or set an alarm or rem reminder as such. So let us see what are the components required today. First of all, we will need an Arduino Uno R3, which is an open source microcontroller board based on Atmega 328P microcontroller. In my case, I have used Arduino Uno. In your case, or according to your availability, you can use Arduino Uno, Nano, Mega, etc. Next, I have used an 16 by 2 LCD display. This uh, LCD display is used for embedded applications to display the output and in this case, it will display the date and time. And if the alarm is ringing, it will show that alarm is ringing. Next, I have used DS3232 which is a real time clock. This keeps track of time and it is a built in 3 volt battery which keeps on updating our time even if it does not have a power source. So this is basically the component which tells us the time and keeps track of time. Next I have used a buzzer which sounds an alarm to alert us about the alarm about the date and time if the alarm is reached. Now let us look at the code. Here, first of all, I have included the DS3231 or DS3232 library and I have included the wire library and the liquid crystal library. This wire library is important because it will help us interface the real time clock with the Arduino. And next, I have initialized the pins of the LED. Next, I have initialized the pins of the real time clock and I have defined a variable and I have taken time t which will tell us the time. Next for the buzzer pin I have taken I have defined the buzzer pin at 13 and I have taken three variables hours, mint and second. This will tell us the hours, minutes and the seconds passed. Next I have taken in this float v out here this is not needed. Okay. Now in the setup I have written wire begin which will initialize the wires library, RTC begin which will initialize the real time clock and serial begin which will initialize the serial port. Since I am not using it real time, we do not need the serial port here. Next I have written pin mode buzz output which will initialize the buzzer pin as output pin. Next I have started the LCD and interface with Arduino and I have set the Cursor I am printing Arduino alarm clock. This will show in the LCD Arduino alarm clock. Next I am setting the date, day of week. First of all I am setting the RTC day of week as Sunday. Today is Sunday so I am setting it as Sunday. Time right now it is 2 pm around 2 pm so I am writing here 14. 14 which is in 24 hour system is 2 pm. And next I have set the date today. Uh, you can set the date, time and day of week according to your needs it does not matter next in lcd begin i am getting the time from in this loop void loop function i am getting the time from rtc this is the real time clock will give us the time through this get time function and will in, and i will in, uh, put the values of r minute and second in the r minute and second variables next i am going to display the time using the lcd and i am going to display the date using the LCD. Next in this if condition I have compared. This this if condition is for the alarm. In I am uh, comparing the current time with the alarm time. That is if the current time is equal to the alarm time the buzzer will sound and it, is, it will display alarm is on and alarm is ringing. So here I have taken the time to be hours 4, uh, 4 14, uh, 14 hours minute 0 and second 10 so that we do not have to wait for a long time. We can see the result soon. Next in the buzzer function I have written the program for the buzzer to be activated and deactivated so that creates a beeping sound and like kind of like an alarm sound. Now let us compile. In your case you can set the alarm time according to your needs. You do not need to set seconds is equal to 10 or hours is equal to 14 or minutes is equal to 0. According whenever you want to uh, want the alarm to ring you can set the time as per your choice. Now I am copying the hex file and I am pasting it to the Arduino board of Proteus. Now let us see simulation. 
as you can see here it is showing arduino alarm clock and it is displaying the time that is 2 seconds have passed and it is 2 o'clock and 2 seconds 2 pm and the date today is 20 june 2021 and here it is also showing so it's helps us compare and now we are going to see with the alarm with alarm will ring or not just as as you can see just as it has it has hit 10 seconds the alarm is ringing and it is going to display alarm on and alarm is ringing and the buzzer is sound so this was our how to create and simulate an arduino based alarm clock using a real time clock that is ds3232 and that was uh, this was the arduino code thank you